What the? Oh, if you want something fun and you want something cool, cool with the K, then this is the place for you. This is Brannigan's channel. Watch my vids. Oh, if you want something weird, something awesome, and something fantastic, this is Burning In Videos. Welcome to my channel. Hello, my name is Brady and Brooke, and welcome to Burning In's Thoughts, episode 6. And I am downstairs in my basement. Okay. I got the microphone set up, even though I don't really need it. Uh, it's hooked up to my more shiny for fire. Okay, so I guess let's get down to business, or maybe I should say the say the date. Hang on, before I get any farther. Yeah, okay, this needs to be adjusted. Uh, professionalism. I boost it up just a wee bit. Okay, I feel better. Okay. Today's uh, today is uh what's today? The tenth? I don't know, today's a Saturday in June. After Oh, today should be the 7th, June 7th, 2014. All right, now, let us, let us get down to business. Uh, well, okay. Okay, so, when I hook up this new HD Sony Handycam video to the computer, for some reason, the videos don't want to go to the video file, the photo gallery or or anything, video gallery, none of that. It goes, it tries to go to Adobe Flash Reader 10 or something like that. I'm like, what? No. No, uh, computer, you don't tell me what to do. I tell you. I am the master. I am controlling you. You don't tell me where to put my videos. You don't, no. You, you don't say, oh, uh, no. I mean, the pictures go to the photo gallery and whatnot. They go to the right place. But not the videos, which is, to me, probably the most important thing. Um, so, I don't know why they do that. That makes no sense. So, that's why I gotta use my brother's laptop to... And the laptop works just fine. Um, and then, also on the computer, when I use the little dazzle thing, you know, I can record the TV... Uh, game, just game footage and stuff. When I do it on for the computer, I have to. Um, it's in like, it's for like DVDs, so it's in DVD like format. So I gotta turn it from DVD DVD format to uh, video format, and then uh, so, and then I put it out of. Uh, so I gotta convert it to. Um, video format with the stuff I downloaded to put into uh, Windows Movie Maker. Anyways, I put it in a window, and so, but then, okay, it looks great, Windows Movie Maker, and you're watching it, alright, and then you publish it, and then that's when the stupid big green ugly bar goes underneath the video. The video is only like that big, and the green bar is that big. It's like, why does it do that? I mean, I try to convert it into different things, it just does that. So, but then on the laptop, which I have a newer version of uh, Windows Live Movie Maker. Well, it's, yeah, it's Windows Live Movie Maker. Have, have that, and then you do, you don't even have to convert the DVD form to video form, it does that for you, so that's always good. And then, um, and you publish it, there's no green bar, so that's why on the Brandy and Plays GTA 5, um, 
even though the audio doesn't match up with the video, my bad, but anyways, so forget that little thing. The, there's no green bar. There's no green bar for the power pad episode. But each time I do that for the for the computer, green bar. Anyways, so uh now let's talk about the new intro. Um I think I personally like the old intro for Vertigan's thoughts better. And you j I'm still planning on using that. That's the main one. But see, that's on the computer and I can't I can't use that anymore because the stupid video from the um uh camera doesn't go to the computer. It's stupid. It doesn't the computer and this camera does just don't work. Um so I had to make a new intro on the on the for the laptop. So but I still plan on using the old old intro once I figure out how to fix the video from the video camera going to the um the computer. Uh and then okay, talk about that and then okay. Um I am planning a channel update, and this pretty much might, might as well be the channel update. Uh, but, uh, see, I don't see what's the point of a channel update for small YouTubers like me at the moment. Like, nobody really watches our videos, so what's the point of making a channel update? They don't really care. Um, so... I want to make a channel update, but who who would watch it? Who watched the nobody? Nobody really watched the videos before the channel update, and nobody would really watch the videos after the channel update as of right now. Uh, so it'd be kind of pointless making a channel update because I mean, who would watch it? Nobody really cares. Um, but then, hey, I figured this could pretty much be a channel update. I mean, I think about YouTube constantly. Absolutely, just all the time. It's kind of sad, but it's my life. And it's just like, I do it for fun, but it's becoming, it's become really my job. Uh, my career right now. I don't get paid from it. Uh, I figured once I get into the thousands views per video every you know I upload a video it gets a thousand views in, in, a, in a day and so maybe that's when I'll start making money off it but and I don't want to advertise because I mean yeah that's what really gets me the views is if you advertise but who wants to sit through freaking advertisements you go to these YouTube channels and it's just like you just want to watch the video and it's just there's advertisement. Um, you guys remember when uh, YouTube actually the titles of the video used to be above the the video. Now it's below it. Uh, took a while to get used to the new update. Um, okay. So so for the channel update, uh, talk about talk about the banner. Okay, I'm gonna talk about the banner that I have on my YouTube channel. It looks like a little kid drew it. Um, Microsoft Paint, this guy. I tried GIMP, but I downloaded it from some not a very trustworthy website. It gave me a bunch of viruses and and the program just didn't really work. The worst thing of all, it changed my web, uh, my, uh, my web browsers. Uh, wow, I really don't like this amplifier settings. Maybe that'll fix it. There you go. Hello. There we go. Thank God. I was going to say thank goodness, but, uh, get that established. Wow. That's, uh, much better. Um, 
let's see the the banner um see people are like hey I want to make you a banner and I'm all like yeah that would be nice but I like I like how everything on my channel is mine I made it all of it you know my intros people look at my intros and they're like hey how about I make you an intro and I'm like yeah, I'm pretty sure you can make a really cool intro, but, uh, but I, I like my intros as of right now. They'll probably, uh, yeah, they're definitely going to change as my videos get better and evolve into something beautiful. Um, let's see. So, talk about my profile picture. That's not my very first profile picture. The one of me in the suit, the black suit and tie wearing... Uh, well, the black and yeah, the black suit and tie, holding the the question mark in front of my face. Um, I like that profile picture simply because I mean, as a question, and I'm Brandon, I'm the Brandon, and uh, I am very weird and don't know what's gonna happen next. Uh, confusing kind of person, so you go to my channel looking for some sweet music that I I made and then you'll be listening to the sweet music that I made and all of a sudden you're watching some weird goofy video from middle school so I like that uh, let's talk about uh, let's talk about you and me uh, okay now on to the more interesting less boring stuff let's uh Talk about talk about making Soundwave for the upcoming school year of 2014-2015. Oh wow, my God, I'll be a junior. Um, well, learning the dance, I thought it was god awful. I thought it was too hard and difficult. And then each time I go home to practice it all by myself, just just forget it. You know, I, I freak, you can't learn a dance in two days, you just can't. Um, so that's high skill level. But the second day after practicing, practicing it in choir, prior to, um, going, standing after, and well, standing in bonfuls, uh, prior to that, and I also stayed in the, um, I relearned the dance, uh, anyways, but it got, it got, you know, much better, and then Friday, going into the audition and practice with uh, my buddies and the people that I uh, audition with a whole bunch of times, and I got, and I eventually, you know, got it. Went up there in the audition and put on a good happy face, and then uh, then I'm like, yes, awesome, express material. That was a good job. I'm actually proud of my uh, proud of my audition, and. Uh, I was very proud. I'm like, you know what? That's express. And then, anyways, last day of school comes around, and then uh, I end up walking home. As I made my journey home, wearing the checkerboard pants and suspenders and bow tie, but, so had to walk home, uh, which it was much further. Then I realized, I mean, it's a lot faster taking a car, I'll tell you that. Uh, but anyway, scary, scary journey walking home. But then my good friend pulled me over on the side of the bridge and picked me up and uh, took me home. So that was nice of you. You know who you are if you watch this. You probably don't, but... Uh, anyways, approaching the bridge, when I, the bridge on 47. Um... I thought it was going to be like the movie Stand By Me with the train and kids running on the bridge. I thought it was going to be like that, but with cars. But anyways, um, so as I began my journey, I'm like, oh man, I should probably turn back around, probably look at the post of Who Made Express and Soundwave. But then I'm like, you know what, it's probably not up yet. And anyways, so as I got home, for my big long journey of walking. I'm like, I go to my friend on Facebook, I'm like, hey, 
to see the show choir list, and he just posted a picture of Express, and I see the people on Express, and I'm looking, I'm looking, and I'm like, uh, I don't see my name under, uh, Express. Uh, that's when I... I'm like, well, let's see, prior to the year, um, I'm like, yeah, if I don't make Express, I'm not gonna do show choir again, because I don't want to do a third year of Soundwave, so, that just... Yeah! I'm gonna have to pick that up. Uh, so, but then, I'm all like, you know what, I will only do it if, if uh, you know, makeup names is say, uh, to say the identities of people in real life. If soccer girl, if, what I said, if soccer girl does it, and, and as well as Fluffy, uh, you know who you are, and some other people people who were in Soundwave previously, if they did it, then yeah, I would do it, you know, it's a big trip year, but it's so expensive. So, if, if they, if they do it, then I would do it. So, but then, I'm pretty sure Soccer Girl's not doing it, so I'm gonna try and convince her to do it, so, so that I would do it. Um, so, uh, so, um, here's, Here's a parody of popular, um, the song that Express did, a parody of it. My problem never was Express, now never with my friends, now I'm kicking it with someone because my audition was not good. Music and lyrics by Bernie and Brooke. Okay. I already talked about that. Okay. So, prior, early, I think, yeah, around Christmas time, I did the tour of churches, you know, fellow Christian, kind of, not really, but I'm like, hey, you know what? I really, I don't get out much, and I really want to see the great town of Troy, Missouri. And so, uh, I did the tour of churches where you went to like five churches and I, I did it for the people but I'm like you know what I'm gonna do as much as I can in choir to help boost up some street cred with the directors and and everybody else boost up some street cred so maybe I can get my name out there Rick you know what Bernie he's he's a serious guy he, he you know he's funny so we we definitely need some character, some new characters in Express. He's, you know, very outgoing. He's nice. Um, and so, you know what? We're going to go ahead and put him in Express. So, I figured, you know, this is what I thought they, you know, well, okay, Bernie in. He had two years in Soundwave, and uh, he, he, uh, had two years in Soundwave. He's gonna be a junior next year, and uh, he actually improved from, you know, oh, wow, it's right answer. He improved quite a bit from last year. You know, he's he's more of a leader than what he was last year. I mean, he's definitely not no leader by any means, but he's more of a leader figure than what he was last year. He improved. He uh, just you know. And the audition went by pretty good, so I figured, yo, Express, just like that. But no! He, with the spiky hair and the rosy cheeks, that was in Soundwave with me last year. L little chubby, I'm not, I'm, I'm not gonna give him a name. Uh, but, uh, he, with the spiky hair and... and rosy cheeks and was in most of the front during the show and all the girls uh, went for him and everything. He, he's the one that makes Express. I'm not jealous, I'm just, I'm just, I'm just saying. One time I went up to him and I'm like, hey, hey, 
person with the spiky hair and rosy cheeks. How do you feel to have your girlfriend being an express and you're in sound wave? And he, <laughs> he got me here. This went deep. He's like, how he, uh, he told me, he's like, hey, Brennan, how does it feel to be in sound wave for second year in a row? So it's just, <coughs> <coughs> so he got me there. That was, like, that got me where I live. Got me deep. And I'm like, ah, oh, you douchebag. Just kidding. Just kidding. You know, you're not a douchebag or anything. You just have the presence of one. Uh, moving on. Uh, let me see. What else? What else? Oh, talk about summer school. Well, Summer school is, uh, well, it's summer school, well, I'm, I'm used to summer school. Did it quite a few times in the past, in the past summers. And, uh, well, let's see, I'm learning some geometry. Yeah, geometry. Anyways, uh, uh, well, there's... There's this one girl who's an incoming sophomore. Really cute face and everything. But it's just like, I look at her and I'm like, I swear, I recognize her from somewhere. Anyways, I went up to her and I'm like, I think I know you from somewhere. I'm like, maybe, maybe, you know, I just, I recognize you. Maybe I know you from a past life or something. Uh, that or she she could look like a younger version of a teacher or something. Somebody. And she she just looks familiar. Uh oh, well. See, uh I got this idea in my head. Uh I might uh I'm like, well, you know what, I could actually write some songs. And they're really not that good and and they take a lot of time and effort and to actually do it, but I'm thinking about um, making a uh, album. I have about 15, 20 songs on there. And I gotta scratch my nose. Except for the people upstairs being all loud. But anyways, um, I could, you know, have an album, and I would, I would actually like advertise this on YouTube to get my name out there and have people actually listen to the album. You put all this work, you want people to see it. And uh, I might make a music video to one of the singles I choose from the album. Make a music video for that. So, that's one thing I'm thinking about doing. And uh, last thing on my list is talk about my Star Wars film that I made in like 6th, 7th grade back in 2010. Uh, well, as you may know, I... Um, uploaded behind the scenes of of the filming and how I felt after filming it. Um, so check that out in the description below. Uh, so I just uploaded that not too long ago. Feel free to check that out. Uh, let's see. I think I'm gonna have to make a purchase in um, a green screen and and soft box lighting because I want to be like the next Smosh, you know. I want to have skits and stuff. Uh, my acquaintance N S Knox, uh, I put his channel in the description of some of my other videos, but N S Knox, uh, he's he graduated this year, and uh, he has some pretty good videos. I have more videos, and he has more views than me, so, and I've been doing it longer, so that's kind of sad. He has like, you know, he could get 300 views on on his, uh, one of his good videos, so I'm going to aim for that. So, uh... I feel like I should have a slogan. Uh, 
like my friend Captain Cough, he says, uh, become a citizen today, or ho, citizens, right, stuff. So I actually have a slogan, so, um, well, this popped up in my head because I'm thinking of making flyers and self-advertising my, my YouTube channel by, uh, printing off picture of my YouTube channel and and on a piece of paper make little flyers and just put them all over the school's hallway you know hallway walls so but then I'm like I need I need something to say that you know to say on there so I think it's gonna say um watch the Bredigan become the Bredigan and uh and well, let's see, saying about that, so, I think the Bredigan is his own little species. And so I need to spread and start a Bredigan nation. And uh, to me, see, Han, I mentioned him in a previous video, um, I called him Mr. Western Civilization slash AP World History. And I, uh, he, he uh, pronounces my name wrong. He pronounces it Brennigan, and so we kind of poke fun of that. But my bad, sorry. Sorry for not correcting you uh, early on the school year. And I correct you once, but I know how hard it must be to change your brain from Brennigan to Brennigan. So I gotta live that now. I gotta live, that. you gotta live that. And so I started thinking, okay, Brennigan. Brennigan. To me, the the word or slash name Brennigan sounds like it's a plural version of Brennigan, doesn't it? You have Brennigan, and then you have Brennigan. I don't know. So watch the Brennigan become the Brennigan. And uh, I'm Brennigan Brooks signing off. Oh, thank you for watching. I'm sorry I put you through that.